We're here with freshman third baseman Cam Gellinger. Cam, it was only a three inning scrimmage today as opposed to the normal six innings. Did, uh, did that change your approach at the plate at all, uh, knowing that you might not get another at bat? No, I was actually more patient up there because I'm knowing the situation up there. So I just need to make sure I be more patient because it's my only at bat and there's a big situation right there. I need so to make sure I picked out the right pitch. So it's kind of the opposite effect. Uh, because it may have been your only at bat, you, you didn't want to get up there and pop up on the first pitch exactly. or anything like that. I didn't want like to roll over or something. <laughs> So let's talk about the uh, the situation that you were in. You had the, the sacrifice fly, which ended up being the game-winning uh, RBI. Mm -hmm. uh, it was runners on first and third with less than two outs. In that kind of situation, what is your what's your approach? What are you trying to do in that kind of yeah, situation? Yeah, I was trying to get one in the outfield. That was my main approach right there. I was just trying to hit one in the outfield, get it in the air. So you guys have even the series at 1-1. Uh, you got to have going to have a true game day atmosphere uh, coming up tomorrow. Yep. Uh, what do you guys have to do to, to get that win tomorrow and win this series for Same the Black thing. team? We need to bring the intensity again. We definitely bring the intensity. Well, Cam, congratulations on the game-winning RBI, and we'll talk to you again soon. All right, thank you. We're here with the winning manager of Game 2 of the Black and Gold World Series, Coach Klosterman. Coach, you guys, even the series today was a shorter scrimmage, only three innings. Did that change the approach uh, with what you told your players, knowing that there was not as many at-bats or not as many batters to face? No, I mean, approach-wise, we didn't really change much. Um, but I tell you what, it was an interesting ball game. When you play those last three innings, uh, you put everything on the line. Um, a lot of pressure situations came up, situational hitting, and obviously on the defensive end. Uh, JoJo had a big play at the plate there, and uh, Cam Gallinger big play at third, getting the lead out on their bunt play at, at third base. So um, overall, the way we managed the game, yeah, hey, uh, when you're playing the last three in a tie, tie, tie ball game, uh, going into the best of three of a series uh, is really important. Talk about Robbie Howell. Uh, freshman came in, pitched really well, uh, almost went the distance. You kind of gave him a little hook there at the end with two outs, but just talk about the job that he did out there. Now, Robbie did a good job. He, he really did. He, uh, he was in trouble for the majority of the night. I think at each inning, they had a guy in uh, scoring position, but you know he, he kept throwing strikes, he kept pounding the zone, and uh, he, he got out of it. Now, coming into that last inning with two outs, uh, runner in scoring position, didn't mess around, brought in Favre for the as the kind of the hammer, the closer there, and he got the job done after uh, putting my man on base. Talk about your what you're winning to your decision in that respect. Yeah, you know, Robbie was throwing the ball well, and uh, you know, I thought with uh, with JV coming up, I thought Rob could get the ground ball double play, and and uh, but uh, when, once uh, once we didn't get the double play, he had two outs. It was time to go get go get Favre, and that's what he's that's what he's here for. That's what he does. He comes in those situations, and and tonight he executed. Well, tomorrow is the uh, the deciding game. Uh, you're looking for your third championship in a row. Who are you going to have on the mound? Tomorrow night we'll be going with Eric Skoglin. I know he's going to be excited about it, but he's uh, he's going to be going up against Joe Murata, who uh, both those guys are uh, high-energy competitors, and I think they're both looking forward to it. Well, Coach, congratulations on the victory, and we'll hopefully talk to you tomorrow. Thank you.